hire them here. But then you knew that, didn't you? <laughs> uh, this time I want to try a little test, some different tests. I haven't been having a whole lot of luck in putting this in the wet fire. This only leaves about an inch between the top of the stove to the bottom of the pot. And I don't think it's enough space for the flame to develop. So I have a couple of stands here that I got from Goodwill that I've been saving to find a use for. I'm going to try this one first. This one, when you put the stove in, it gives me about an inch and a quarter between the top of the stove to the bottom of the pot. Another change I'm going to try is instead of the fiberglass, whenever I let this burn out the fiberglass is melting and then it doesn't work so hot the next time. And instead of carrying a bunch of fiberglass, most of us carry cotton balls. So I'm going to try it in there. I tried it once. It does burn it. Then what you do is you just flip it over and use the good side. So you should be able to get like two burns out of a cotton ball. Again with the 10 milliliters of denatured alcohol. Put that in there right on the cotton. Uh, 10 milliliters is about the equivalent to two teaspoons and I think, is that a half an ounce? Not sure. I have one cup of water setting at 59 degrees. Let's light this up and see where this goes. There we have 210. 11 212 degrees at 1239 that's kind of baffling okay let's let this run out okay and there it's burning out at 15 One last hurrah here. Okay, got the sixteen. Let's just say sixteen to burn out. Now there, I don't know, that's kind of surprising. Using this burner on the wet fire, although maybe the cotton makes a difference. When I did it on the wet fire stove, using insulation, it brought the uh, one cup of water to boil in 10 minutes and 35 seconds. This brought it to boil in 12 minutes 39 burnout at 16 uh, the burnout on the other one was 14 minutes 18 seconds so maybe this is acting as a heat sink somewhat and keeping the stove cool maybe I should plus you know, or it's the cotton I should try this on the stove with the uh, cotton and see what it does so let me try that be right back. There's 210, 211, 212 at 1039. Let's try for run out. 
Okay. We have 1442, let's say, to run out. It's really just burning the cotton there now. That's interesting. In the three times that I ran this once off camera, two on, two with fiberglass rather, the first test of the fiberglass I got 1035, uh, then 1039 for boil of one cup. Then when I changed to the cotton, I got 10, 1039. So that's only like maybe four seconds difference. And time to run out was 1418, and this is 1442. So, kind of looks like insulation or cotton doesn't make a whole lot of difference, except that cotton is easier to carry. I may do another test <clears throat> on this without cotton, just the stove itself empty with just alcohol. And then another one that Broken Arrow suggested, suggested was putting the you know pot, the stove part, underneath and set the wet fire on the top. And let's see what that does. So that will probably be the next test. So thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now. Happy trails to you Until we meet again Happy trails to you Keep smiling until then Who cares about the clouds?